running this 1997 Honda 50 horse inline three cylinder four stroke with three carbs um, all together on this motor I replaced the gear oil I had to pump out quite a bit of motor oil uh, from the from the engine uh, it was way too full so I pumped it uh, out to a good level um, what else did I do I pulled the whole all the here turn this off real quick So all together on this motor, new gear oil, um, one of the uh, vacuum lines wasn't connected so I reconnected that. Uh, the carbs adjustments were all off. Um, this one was about a turn out, this one's like a turn and a half out, and this one was like three quarters turned out. And so I'd start them all at uh, one turn and fine tune them from there. So that was off, pumped out a whole bunch of engine oil. Um, and also, when I had this cover and everything off to inspect the belt, I noticed that the charge coils underneath the flywheel uh, was burnt up. And so, after I went through the motor, put it in water and stuff, and ran it, uh, I disconnected the battery cables going to the motor with the motor running, and it's only getting like 0 .09 volts coming out of it. Yeah, so it's not charging whatsoever. The charging system is fried under the flywheel and charge coils so that's something that should be replaced um i wasn't able to take off the top of the thermostat uh, cover to check the thermostat um the, those bolts holding it in is i i don't want to snap nothing so i left them alone feels like if i was going to torque on them anymore that they'd snap so i didn't even bother with that um his electric choke so I disconnected the wiring and hooked it up to 12 volts and it's working. So uh, somewhere between the connection and the controls is the issue with that. But I'd have to pretty much uh, take the controls off and apart and uh, find that choke wire and do troubleshooting and stuff. But besides all that, <laughs> The motor's running damn good. Oh, I also pulled the spark plugs out and uh, cleaned them and gapped them too. Uh, the motor's pissing water great. It's not getting hot or anything. It's shifting fine. I had to adjust the idle also. That's another thing I had to do. Um, but yeah, the main issue that he's having right now is it's not charging. Um, if he has good batteries, so basically he's using the batteries just to crank over the motor and also for the voltage uh, for like this light right here, the oil pressure light, when I disconnected the battery cables for the motor, that light went off because it's not getting the voltage that it needs to keep running it. So, yeah. Not charging and electric choke not working. <laughs>